Sarasota County residents will have three new options to get to evacuation shelters this hurricane season. SNN Samantha Sonner has the latest on those changes. Weeks before hurricane season, Sarasota County is updating their evacuation transportation plan thanks to lessons learned from Hurricane Irma. How can we help residents take action? And, and so while we haven't had a ton of people complaining, well, we couldn't get to a shelter, we identified that it is a potential issue. Emergency Services Director Rich Collins says the after action report identified many in the county with no transportation or not enough for their whole family. To make evacuating easier, they worked with Sarasota Schools and Sarasota County Area Transit on three transportation options. We have identified 17 rally points across the county, all the way from Longboat Key down to Inglewood. And a citizen can drive to one of those local rally points and receive transportation to a shelter. Special SCAT routes will also take you to a shelter. Residents using these services will not be able to choose what shelter they go to. The SCAT services will move to what's a disaster, what's called a disaster route, which is a modified Sunday route, and citizens can go to any one of the Sunday route pickups and be picked up and taken to a shelter. For those unable to travel to bus services, SCAT will be working to pick residents up from their homes. Maybe they're shut in and have no means of transportation, no friends, no family, nobody around that can get them to a shelter. What we've put together is a registration program. Those citizens that are in that, uh, in that have that, those issues can register online. This is a different registry than the medical needs registry for those requiring special assistance when evacuating. Reporting in Sarasota, I'm Samantha Sonner, SNN, the Suncoast News Network. And you can find Sarasota County's full transportation plan and links to register online by visiting our website. That's SNNTV.com.